We're going to head up to a spot where we've got a great overlook of the entire West Ruin and also be able to see some of the other components of what made up this community. This is a great spot to be able to get an idea of the entire community of Aztec. The community originally started up on the bluffs behind us here to the north. Up until 1050, there was really no habitation in this specific locale. And it looks like they prepared this entire region area for the next, oh, couple of decades, maybe 10, 10 years where they spent stockpiling wood and clearing out this area and building it up and smoothing it out and building platforms to build this big community that they con conceived all at once. It included the entire area around here and the number of buildings. It was all a preconceived, engineered, directed construction that took decades, actually even probably a century to complete. This particular building, this West Ruin, was built in actually a very short amount of time. They first started construction right in the center where the archaeologists are working today. Maybe Akiva and a couple buildings went up in the early 1100s. And during that time, they were stockpiling wood and preparing this site. Then they quickly, the, the east and north blocks of the site went up from about 1109 to 1113, but mostly the majority of it in 1111. Put it up very quickly, spent some time in the 1113 stockpiling more wood, and then completed this west ruin, this west wing, and the encircling rooms to the south, all within a couple of years for the most part, completing it between 1115 and 1120. So in a very short amount of time, this entire building here was put up. This west ruin was put up during a time of high moisture and moisture that was very good and arriving at the right time for agriculture. What I find fascinating is they continued on that grand plan that had been conceived in the late 10 hundreds. They continued to work on that for generations. They may have to pause, it may slow down a little bit as times got tough, but that grand scheme of building this center continued from generation to generation, um, up until the point when times got too tough here in the late 1200s and they did leave for better areas to the south.